everybody so I'm just gonna record this really quick video on an in-car first aid kit um Riley scraped her knee at the playground the other day and um her gamma didn't have like any first aid kit stuff in the car so she had to go to the park head person to get stuff so we decided it'd probably be a good idea to get little first aid kits put together for in our cars just in case she's with us and she scrapes her knee or something so I'm gonna walk you through what I put together really quick and I've got another video coming later tonight so first I went to Hobby Lobby and Publix for my two deals so if you live in an area where you have Hobby Lobby and Publix this is a deal for you if not you'll have to go to your other local supermarkets but um at Hobby Lobby I purchased a cute little tin lunchbox that's princess and my theory was that if it's like princess she won't be as afraid of like getting her knees or her hands or whatever is scraped up cleaned up so I got a princess thing it's supposed to be $5.99 but with their 40% off coupon I only paid $3.59 for the tin lunchbox and then inside I got a thing of Kids Neosporin plus pain relief. It's supposed to have like, it's for ages two and up and it's a cream and it's supposed to have like um, a numbing medicine external and, and a analgesic, I guess that means numbing, I don't remember. Um, some princess band-aids, some big band-aids that and the key is it's a big band-aid that seals all the way around. So it's got the pad, but it seals all the way around the cut. And a bottle of hydrogen peroxide. And I'm going to put in here some cotton balls and um, cotton swabs and um, like a sucker or a piece of candy maybe. And probably um, like gauze and some tape. For like hands perhaps it dep you know I'm just gonna I'm gonna put whatever I can fit in here so I stack it in this is what it looks like with just the band-aids and stuff in there and then I take the neosporin and when I open the neosporin I'll just stick it in there but right now I've got it like laying in there like that so with this deal the Big band-aids were $265, the princess band-aids were $269, the Neosporin was a $539, and then the Publix brand of peroxide was $0.55. Cents. There was a $1.25 coupon for the Neosporin, and then there were band-aid coupons for $0.75 cents off, so I got to use those twice. So I saved $2.75. But I also have a manufacturer coupon at home that is if you buy any three band-aid products. So it's like band-aids, Neosporin, and some other random stuff. You get two dollars off. So I'm going to get another two dollars off. So this 932 that I actually that I paid is really only going to be like 732 with my when I get my other coupon added into it. Um so that's just a really quick video on a cute little first aid kit to keep in the car. Um I'm in Kayla's car today because my car broke down. That's another story. Anywho, but cute little first aid kit to keep in the car. When it's completely done and I've got the cotton balls and everything in there, I'll show it to you again. Um, but I just, I think it's going to be a good idea for everybody to keep that in their car. So, hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys later tonight for another video. Bye. So, I finished the little first aid kit and I'm going to show you what the final product is like. I added some other stuff into it, so I'm going to show you now. That's my cat. Hi, Cloister. She wants to show us her butt. Okay, so the first aid kit, I added a little snack size Ziploc bag with cotton swabs and cotton balls, the super size ones, um, some Jolly Rancher candies, a little bit of medical tape, and in this box I added some little just plain gauze pads, a couple of those. And then some really big gauze pads. My theory was if she scrapes up like the palm of her hands and stuff, these band-aids aren't going to 
the big band-aids that I bought aren't going to be big enough to cover a really, really large area. So I figured a gauze pad and some surgical tape will help. Um, these, this is the paper surgical tape because I have a adhesive allergy. So these don't even really work with me. They still break me out really bad. But um, hopefully with her, just to get her home and get her doctored a little bit better, it'll be okay. And then it all just... Tucks back in. It keeps like sliding off my lap. My lap's not square shaped. And then snap shut. Mm, snap shut. No. Told you it would close. So that is my in car first aid kit. If you guys decide to make one, leave a clip in the com or your link in the comment below, and I'll talk to you guys in a little while because I'm about to make the other video. See you soon. Bye.